And in a southern town, you're not known for your address, you're known for the name of the house that you live in. Welcome to the Still House on Poplar Avenue. Built by two friends not long after World War II in 1945 and eventually became a stamp in history for those who live in the city of Philadelphia. Walker Hayes and Richard Moffis built the house. They were friends before the war. They came back and built the duplex for their families. Uh, they were here for several, several years. And at some point around the 70s, Sarah Steele bought the house. And uh, it is a duplex. She lived on the left side of the house and she's always rented out the other side of the house. So you might recognize the owners of this now Airbnb. Yeah, well, Tony got. Alexander owns Steve's on the Square in Philadelphia and Dr. Gwen Alexander is a talent and gifted teacher at Neshoba Elementary. But they decided to take on a new role to provide travelers a home away from home when visiting Philadelphia. I think the Christmas of 2019 and we're looking for a property, maybe as our forever house. And uh, we came across this and we thought, you know, one day this would be perfect for an Airbnb. Gwen, my wife, just retired from Georgia, the state of Georgia, as an educator for 30 years. And we were looking for her a project for when she got here. And uh, it just felt like the perfect fit. And so far it's been just that. And for those that don't know much about Airbnbs, it's a service that allows homeowners to rent out their property on the internet to people looking for a place to stay. A lot of people don't like to stay in hotels anymore. They want kind of a home feel and it's completely furnished, has everything you need, a refrigerator, a washer and dryer, and it's just a great place to stay. The Alexanders say they've had a lot of traction since they launched the still house for rent three weeks ago. The first time we put it out like it was live on Facebook and live on Airbnb, we've had some of the, um, some people who have called are for graduations in May. People are coming into town that they don't have enough room for at their family's house, so they've decided to stay at the Airbnb and celebrate. Um, we've had wedding parties that want to have a bridal party here. Um, we've had People staying for the casino, they're staying for a concert. The Alexander say travelers can stay a minimum of two days at the still house and even rent up to two months or more. And if you would like to book a stay at the still house on Poplar, you can call Gwen Alexander at 706-329-2915 or visit the story on our WTOK website.